Mingala Bakamia, I'm Angus Watson with the top stories for DVB. Opposition leader Aung San Suu Kyi met with Army Chief Min Ong Lai on Monday for the first private talk since the Nobel laureate led her National League for Democracy to a sweeping election victory late last year. Not many details of the closed-door meeting have been released. However, the NLD leader and the Commander-in-Chief did discuss the transition process that's ongoing between the military-backed Union Solidarity and Development Party and the NLD. The process will be completed when Suu Kyi's party becomes Burma's government in April. The meeting comes after the Defence Chief met with Burma's press council on Sunday, when he pledged to work with the veteran journalists to improve the Army's relationship with the media. A landslide at a Rangoon construction site left three workers dead on Sunday morning. The accident occurred at a Miangon Township monastery and was caused when eight workers dug into, into a soil retaining wall. The three were trapped by rubble inside a hole 25 feet deep. Firefighters worked to pull the men out of the hole but were too late. The victims were aged 25, 35 and 38. Remaining in Rangoon and shots were fired on Sunday as police arrested two high-profile fugitives on the city's outskirts. Police launched the special operation on Sunday to apprehend fugitives Cho Win Sane and Nain Min Thu, also known as Nipyorthi, meaning banana. In a statement, Rangoon police said Cho Win Sane resisted arrest and threatened authorities with a blade, prompting officers to shoot at the house. The suspects subsequently surrendered. Cho Win Sane and Nai Min Thu are both escaped criminals, wanted on a variety of violent crimes, including injuring police officers. Rangoon police say they took a tip off on the pair's Shui Pitha hideout from social media. Staff at a prominent Bagan hotel held a successful strike on Monday after demanding that they be paid Burma's minimum wage. 80 of the AR Riverview Hotel's 160 staff staged a sit-in at the hotel's grounds beginning early in the morning. They were demanding 3,600 chats per day, the $2.80 fee set as Burma's first minimum wage last year. The debate was resolved with the aid of the Ministry of Hotels and Tourism and Labour officials after the hotel signed off on the workers' demands. You can find more on all of today's top stories at dvb.no. Bye for now.